Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can create foreign key in PHP My Admin. First of all, I have two tables here. There is customers table and customer details table. So why do we need foreign key in, in the first place? So we have these customers in our customers table, right? So we only have information like email, first name and last name. And there is another table called customer details that does not have anything as of now, but it has additional details for the customer that says company, country, phone and website. So we need foreign key to link these two tables, customer details and customers. Let's say I want to add additional details for this Cheryl Baxter. Okay, so I'll just do insert and ID will be automatically generated. So I'll just write the customer ID. So the customer ID for Cheryl is one. Okay, so I'll write one here. Let's say the company is Google and country is USA. Phone is, uh, let's just enter some random numbers here and the website is google.com so if i go here click on go this data will be created and if i browse as you can see it says customer id 1 google usa and so on so now we know that uh, this is additional details for this customer but they are not actually linked so if they are not linked if i delete this this will be dangling so it will have customer id 1 but we will not have any customer with ID one. So let's say if I delete this, okay, it will be deleted. And now if I check here, there's a column, there's a row with customer ID one, but there is no user with customer ID one. So this is what happens when you don't add foreign key. So let's say I change this to customer ID two. So then we logically know that this is the details for customer ID 2 that means the ID is 2 for Preston so now let's add foreign key so to do that click on structure click on relation view and we want to link customer ID in this table to the ID in this table so that we know these two are the same thing so what we do is uh, just give it a name I'll say CST SK key it does not matter and we know we want to see what we want to do where if the parent is deleted so we want to restrict the deletion and we want to add this to customer id and the customer id is linked to customer tables id so what this means is this id is equals to this id if i save this and if i browse here now customer id 2 also becomes clickable so we have this details here that says uh, this ID is unique identifier for this table and for customer ID 2 company is Google country is USA and phone is this and website is this if you want to check who is customer ID 2 I can just click on this and the details for Preston will open so now if I delete Preston accidentally or uh, however it will, sh it will say that cannot delete or upgrade parent row for constraints fails. this is because if we delete the parent what do we need to do with the child in order to delete the parent first we need to delete the child and then we can delete the parent otherwise there will be child but there will be no parent so it is uh, there's no relationship there and that is kind of an error so that's why we need to first delete child and then delete parent or what we do is when the parent is deleted child is also automatically deleted that is another case but uh, we'll discuss that later so this is how you can add foreign key in phmyadmin if you have any questions let me know in the comments below